Hello and welcome back to Robocop Rogue City. Part 9. Let's get crocking. Okay, so we're back. Um, we're gonna leave. That's it. We're off. We're going to the mall. Yeah, we're gonna fail these. Be kind. So that was the videotape, and I don't know what Serve and Protect 2 was, but uh, we're not doing it, so I don't really uh, need to know. Okay, um, I can see a big showdown going on in here. What about you guys? Uh, something that I noticed in the last video, because it's very easy to miss things when I'm recording. I don't, I mean, I should notice them, but I don't. And then when I come to edit, um, I kind of pick up on things and what? Oh, so I can go that way? Oh, sorry, yeah. I have to go that way. Yeah, I pick up on things, and and uh, just something I noticed that it didn't really inform me of, which I feel as though it should have done. In my little, um, in my little um, weapons, uh, you know, in the health bar area in the bottom right of the screen, some I think I use some uh, points to upgrade certain things, and now there's more abilities, I guess, because it looked like you could press B to do your health, and then do something else and something else. So, yeah. to do some psycho presentation. And who is the big wig? That's what I want to find out. Mr. W, we still have no contact with the Funhouse. I'm on the phone. We're ready. I understand, but please tell him that this is not a meeting that can be postponed. I see. So, they ain't coming, right? Fucking suits! Keep your anger to yourself, or I'll share mine with you. Robo? Who's there? Show yourself! You'd better not. As you wish, creep. You are under arrest. Come quietly. Do you really believe that's what's gonna happen? Take care of him, boys. I'll meet you on the roof. What's up, metal freak? Forget where you left your car? You better go, Miss Ortiz. It seems there will be trouble. I thought he was going to say, no survivors. Right, good start. You see in the bottom corner, it's, uh, whoa. What was that? A uh, sniper? <clears throat> right. Let's move up, move up. Yeah, I'm going to just try these out quick. So, I got a super punch that I guess needs to reload. Uh, A. Ooh, that's like a start forward, I guess. I wonder why the game didn't sort of notify me of that. Because it definitely... Which way is that guy looking? Yeah, it definitely didn't seem to, so I'm like, what the... Bosh. The walls were kind of glitching over here. Like, they still are now. In the cutscene, they were like glitching. They are now, it's really weird. They're like pulsing? What, what's that about? I mean, I guess that's a glitch and not something I should be using. But, you know, like secret compartments. Hey. What's up? What's up? Uh. We're going well. I'm always happy when we start an episode and, uh. We're st whoa, whoa, whoa. So what? Whoa, oh, oh, he's behind me! Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Not cool. <sighs> well. Hey, you metal fuck! Wanna go first? Fleet total robo cap! <laughs> Come on. 
Come on, Robo. Pull through. Where did they go? Which way am I going? Oh, we just have no idea now. Alex? Oh. Is that you? Come to us. Yeah, Dad, yeah, Dad we're waiting for you. Where are you? Where are you? This looks never ending. Yep. Okay then. Did I just fail? Oh no, that's the car that just hit me. Okay. Uh, yeah, so we've got that. I don't know why that's... What's that for? Can I go like... What's this? Okay, so we go like that and then bash like that. Okay. That's kind of hard to do because it's A and then uh, the D-pad, so you have to kind of take your finger off the analog stick, which is pushing you forwards. It's uh, a little weird, that is. It's weird how, um, as well, that I wanted to mention, is that when that Wendell smokes, Dad? Robocop, like, has a meltdown. It's weird. He sparked up a cig, and then we were like, ugh! Cigarettes? What's that about? He's Dad? doing something to us somehow. Dad, are you here? I'm here, son. I'm scared. Come don't find don't me, worry, son. <laughs> Robocop's here. Why won't you come for me, Dad? Well, this is horrible. Don't leave me, please. Don't leave me alone. Cool section. Oh, I thought there was an upstairs to, uh... Aha! Maybe we found a secret for once. Uh, no. No. <laughs> Can you fly? No. Um, yeah, I was thinking that we might have found something, like a secret. Is this a boss fight with Wendell Antonowski? Antonowski? One spark can save your life. Can I just bosh him one? Oh, they're mannequins. I thought that was Wendell. <laughs> oh, not mannequins. Come on. Come on. Why the mannequins? Are they going to move when I turn around? They've moved. I wonder if they all... They did move. I'm getting uh, condemned criminal origins vibes here because that I think that happens in uh, yeah this is where we go here hello I'm here uh, hang on a second we need a jump too maybe I can unlock a jump sometime let's uh, but we can do that I'm wondering if all these people are gonna like turn into people and this is us like Sort of tripping out a bit, and then it's gonna be like we come back to. Over here, Murphy. You know, like they might turn into normal people. Leave me alone. Is he in there or round here? Maybe round here. No, through the store. Through the store. Okay, this is creepy. Creepy little section. Where are you, Wendell? Is that you? You, you? you look different. You're scaring me. Elf? I don't like how scary you are now. It's not your dad, kid. It's not even a police officer. I don't know what it is anymore. Was that the mum who just said that? Like, that's... That's harsh. That's horrible. She's like, I don't even know what it is. It's not even a police officer. Well, I've done more policing in the last eight episodes than half of my unit. Where have I gone to? I thought I was just going into an alleyway. Where did I go in? Oh my god, I'm so lost. What the... What in the hell? 
Is this where we came in? It bloody well is where we came in. I'm so turned around now. Wow, that's uh, trippy. Or is it just me being stupid? I don't know. Oh, hello there. Yeah? Yeah? That's what you get. You come at me, bro. That's what you get. The remains of my husband, a police officer killed in the line of duty, were used to create some kind of a metal monster. I need to bury it to move forward with my life. Do you have a funeral suit that would fit that empty shell? This got deep real quick. This is like the best mission so far. All the ladies have been sort of groped. What's going on there? A cop. So, top floor. Nowhere else to go, Wendell. Unless he's in a chopper on the roof. Which is likely the case, to be honest. Did you hear? It's true. Whoa. You're Kinda. not one of us anymore. You're not human. And you're not a real cop. You're just the rotting remains of Alex Murphy. You're something that should never have been. Something that should not exist. We have to fix you. We have to erase you. Oh my god. And we will. Just come to us. Come to the rooftop. We're waiting. I'm assuming at this... Wow, god, I just got side... Uh, I just got sent back, look. Oh no, this is like a glitch. Okay. Uh Oh, am I supposed to do something here? There's no way back. Okay, so is there a puzzle in here? I'm getting this feeling like there might be a puzzle. Unless you open that door. What in the hell? Oh no, we did it. We, yeah, that was easy. Okay, so, I'm getting the feeling here that like maybe Wendell is like hacking us. Could be. Because I can't see his wife saying all of that. Like, his wife wasn't like that in the film, was she? She was, uh, you know. Uh, I can't go in there. She was, uh, you know, a good person, wasn't she? Oh my god, what's gonna happen here? Oh no, I see an ad! Wait, I see all the police. Oh dear. They're going to ambush me in a boss fight on the roof and I gotta fight another Ed. And there's nowhere, nowhere to hide. Brilliant. Let's go. Okay. Oh dear. Get him, Ed! <laughs> it's the crap that is stuck to our shield. A cuckoo egg planted by OCP. We need to clear our station of this shit. We must smash that thing. Fire at will. You're not one of us. You feel that too, don't you? Whoa! Have I got tinnitus, or is this... Yeah, <laughs> it's the game. <laughs> oh my god. There's like a like a high-pitched uh, ringing in the back. I was like, oh my god, have I got... Roll me? Okay. This isn't where Robocop lived, is it? Dad, can you fix the camera? I think something's broken. Son. Oh, okay. That's not an upstairs. What's the point of those stairs? Well, I guess this is dream world, so... Oh, these are pictures of us and our kids. Oh, no. Yep. Hey, you fixed it! Remember I'm playing a game this afternoon? Dad wouldn't miss it, would he? Pick me up at the station. I'll grab my gear. 
Do Is this... you really have to go? You look so sexy in that uniform. Why won't you stay a little longer? Leaf work. Okay. I, I was gonna say then, the game's glitched again because it, it still said examine the camera. And... <sighs> Why? How do I not just go out the same way? I was gonna say, this is not rel um, relative to the, uh, how nice that apartment was to be the out, you know, the, the, the landing. Where on earth are we now? Have we been here? Yeah! This is the biker yard! With, uh, yeah, I remember going out of that door. Do you not love your family? No attachments. Yes, I know this area. I know it, I think. Wendell... Don't take him away from me! Everyone wants to be back home with their families. Be back home. This is like trauma, man. This is like super trauma. Yeah, I know this area. So then that guy- Oh, this is where that clown, whatever it was, showed up. No! Was it a clown? No, it was like a thing. I don't know what it was. Oh. Uh. Welcome, Chopper. Let's, Let's take, take a stroll, stroll through your-, through your... Oh. Do you think you can just go back? Yeah, Wendell's- Wendell's doing us here, isn't he? This is a one-family house, built by ZM Industries. It's for sale because the head of the family to which it belonged was shot in the head. Your family- I was gonna try and bash that. Why do you want to remember? You attach yourself to something that is the weakest in you. To the part that's still human. Have you thought it over? Why not make me an offer? Where's the last one? And where's the door gone? Oh, this is so trippy. What is your sacrifice worth? Holding on to them makes you weak. Destroy them. Destroy them before they destroy you. Is it by the front door? Whoa. Alex Murphy. The one and the only. I'm here because you have something that belongs to me. You have my badge. Lewis gave it to me. Lewis is hurt because of you. Because you keep insisting that you're something that you're not. You think that you're a machine that's simply using my brain, but that's not true. I'm dead, and I want to finally rest, but you won't let me. Your delusions keep tormenting me and my family. You need to let us go. I want my badge back. I have it. So I remember. Remember what? The lie? Lewis knows us. She would not lie. Give it to me. It's mine. But, Lewis, I want it back. This is my badge. Then I'll have to take it back myself. God. You are strong, strong enough, enough to take, take him. him. Don't, Don't forget, forget you, you have, have a partner, partner who's counting on you. Take, take this gift. gift. Don't, Don't forget, forget who you, who you are. are. Alex, Alex Murphy. Murphy. Get up, Robo. Get up, for God's sake. That's it, Robo. Keep going. Where's the chopper? The cops will be here any- Wendell Antonowski. Haven't you had enough yet? You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Relax. I I'm not your enemy. If I were, you would have already... You have the right to an attorney. Hey, I, I wanted to help you. Release you from the burden of your past life, of your memories. But you, you don't want to lose them, right? Now I get it. Anything you say may be used against you. I can give you back those memories. All of them. We should help each other. We have the same boss! Police! God damn it, you again? People need to see this. Uh. Cuff him. He is a cop killer. Hands behind your back! Can you hand me my lighter? 
It's a family heirloom. I wouldn't want to lose it. You mean this trinket? It'll be safer in the prison depository. You'll pick it up yourself in... I don't know, 150 years? Plenty of time for rehabilitation. Wow! Top story. Wendell Antonowski, the infamous new guy in town, has been apprehended today. Robocop was able to capture Antonowski, as reported by an eyewitness, Channel 9's Samantha Ortiz. Unfortunately, no footage of the event has emerged. Robocop's efforts have prompted a public debate regarding his status as a human being. Here's a statement from John Mills, a candidate for the mayor's office in the upcoming mayoral election. Today, Robocop has done more for this city than the current administration has done in its entire term. That's why I feel that it's time to give something back. If elected, I will be advocating to grant Robocop the status of a free, living human being. That's right. Vote Mills, vote Robocop. Staying on the topic of OCP, the CEO of Omni Consumer Products suffered a heart attack earlier today. The self-made entrepreneur has been taken to the Gibson Memorial Hospital for observation. His condition is stable. We wish you a speedy recovery. Wendell's in prison and the old man is on his way out. Could this day be any better? Geez, Steph, don't you have any respect? Here's the man of the hour. Congrats, Robo. You caught that bastard for what he did to Lewis. We are not done yet. Murphy, come talk to me after you're done with your evaluation. Okay then, so a lot of information there. First and foremost, I'd like to apologize for the game that just glitched on me w when that newsreader was uh, talking and it like froze, but that wasn't like my stream or anything, that was uh, that was the game. I did that, and yeah. I knew he'd get him. Not ideal. I just knew he'd be the one to bust that asshole. What else was I going to say about that little section? It was great, I really enjoyed it, it was fantastic, that's the best part of the game so far. Um, Wendell, I guess now he's arrested, see, like he said, we have the same boss, and I honestly think his boss is the old man, and I'm wondering if, why is the old man gone to, uh, hospital, hmm, I don't trust that old guy, at all, as you can probably tell, I mean, I might be wrong, but, yeah, okay, let's see how we did. Something not many people know about me, I used to be a car mechanic before I landed this job. Is that supposed to put us at ease, Morgan? What did we get? Yeah, this... Domestic terrorist, okay. Oh, okay, so it includes everything, yeah. Junebury Mall secret found. What was that? Just the box? Maybe that was something then, the under the stairs. Samantha's belongings, yeah. Go on, give us a B. Yes! Back to a B. How many skill points we got? Three. Cool. Congratulations on catching Wendell. You seem to constantly be front page news. Not only that, your situation has become a topic of public debate. I imagine that could take a toll on anyone. How are you dealing with other people trying to determine your identity for you? Someone is fighting for my rights. That's probably the healthiest way of looking at it. But the status of a human would make you an autonomous being. It opens many doors. Being given human rights would let you fully take control of your life. Is that something that you'd actually want? Being given rights is... Would set you... Uh... Hmm. Yeah. Yes, I deserve it. And why is that? I am human. The idea of granting you human rights is a very important issue, but no more important than the main reason for today's session. Many people might not be aware of that, but I have the whole report on the heavy glitches that you suffered before capturing Wendell. The only other time you've experienced anything similar was during the slaughterhouse incident. That's when your partner was wounded. Now, 
you were fighting the person responsible for it. Do you think the severity of those glitches is caused by the intense feelings that you have towards either of them? Hmm. I just seek justice. My partner is important. I needed to do right by her. I know how close she is to you. Let's dig a little deeper. Your typical glitches are triggered by sensory stimulation, similar to how most people experience memories when exposed to particular sights, sounds, or smells. But this wasn't the case with the other glitches that you experienced recently? No, they triggered randomly. That's what I suspected. And now tell me, what did they seem like to you when you experienced them? Yeah, nightmares. Nightmares. I think we're on to something. Your usual glitches were making you recall memories. No more harmful than remembering your wedding day when hearing Mendelssohn's march. We have to differentiate them from those severe malfunctions that you experienced in the slaughterhouse and at the mall. Those latter ones are the real problem, and we need to get to the bottom of it. But I think I've gathered quite a lot of valuable data, and at our next session, I'll present my conclusions. Hey, Robo, could you stop by the cells on your way to read? Someone there wants to speak to you. I guess it's Pickles. Um, one thing I did want to mention that I just thought of when he took the mask off. When we saw Murphy as a man, um, I felt like the character design didn't look as accurate as when we're sitting in that chair and we've got our mask off. Like, that looks just like the movie as far as I can remember. Looks a lot like uh, Peter Weller. But... Um, I felt like the actual human version of him just didn't. It didn't really look like him much. I was like, oh, why don't they use the same face model and put hair on it? Maybe they did. It just looks weird. I don't know. Recognize those I uh, steps anywhere. Yeah. Over here, Tin Man. Biggles. What did you do this time? Uh, why does it have to be that I did something? Maybe one of your guys just got a little over eager. Did they? No. But. None of this matters. I'm here mainly to congratulate us. We did it. We got the guy. We? We sure did, partner. Any new leads? Are you looking for trouble? This is the they lived happily ever after part of the story. Wendell was conducting suspicious activity for someone at OCP. I want to know who. Shit. I thought you were just looking to avenge your partner. I forgot that you're a dutiful officer. All right. I'll keep my ear to the ground and see what the streets are saying. Good. Nice. Talk so, yeah. I had some uh, something else I just thought of that I wanted to mention, but I've now forgotten what it was. What was it? He said something then, Pickles. Uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know. The old man had a heart attack. I'll think of it. Hey, I think you locked me out again. I can't hear you. We're busy uh, working. Sorry, I'm not helping you. Yeah, I get it. Well, this was that other guy's office. What the hell? <laughs> Catching Antonowski put a smile on a lot of people's faces, but we still have one unresolved issue. Catching his accomplice at OCP. Exactly. And when everyone realizes that OCP's been sabotaging us the whole time, mentions of a strike will come up again. We don't want that. So who do you think it is? Becker is an obvious choice. I just don't know if that's not too obvious. Do you suspect that Becker is on Windows payroll? Hmm. I guess... I, it's not giving, really giving me an option to say no, is it? I'm not sure of it. All signs point to him. They do, don't they? And that leads me to another thing. Becker wanted to meet you. You're supposed to show up at some old factory. And he wanted you to come alone. A rather <laughs> unusual request. That's why I'll get Officer Washington to listen in. By the way, how do you feel about it? Can you trust him? Who? Oh. oh! Wait, wait. 
I think he means, yeah, he means the young kid. Despite shortcomings, he is trying his best. That makes me a little less anxious about signing him up to look after you. I'm skeptical of anyone that OCP tries to push on us. First Becker, then Washington. And let's not forget about Dr. Blanche. Speaking of which, Dr. Blanche, is she... Is she being helpful? Are you getting anything out of those sessions? She is an enormous help. She listens. Good. That's good to hear. Sometimes that's all it takes. I will meet Becker, but there is a place I will visit first. Sure thing. In the meantime, I'll brief your overseer. I don't think that, uh, the therapist... Washington. Yes, sir. He ain't that He's short, for God's sake. He's as tall as that guy. Way. Every time they're like, shortcomings, even Robocop said it, it's like, leave him alone. Okay. Um. Oh, are we leaving? Is that what we're doing? Yeah, we're leaving and I'm in the wrong place, I guess. I swear there was a stair set. There is. There is. Um, oh yeah, what I wanted to mention was obviously that Mills character who was calling us when we were near, like in the city, and he was like, oh, come on, come on. And I was like, who the hell's that? Well, that's obviously now been revealed as being the mayoral candidate. Now, I don't know if he's already been mentioned. He could have been, but I don't think he... I don't think he was. I had no idea who that guy was until he was on the TV, but, you know... Oh, okay, so we've gone to the hospital. Okay, then. We're gonna go and see Anne, then. I don't know what's wrong with our team. I want to throw the TV out the window, but it was too heavy. I pulled the hamstring. Wait, why are you asking me about my liver and kidneys? They shot me in the leg. We can offer you a higher standard of accommodation. It looks like the same person as that Wait, reporter girl. It's like very similar. Hey, man. Is she dead? Have they taken her? Come on. Give me the skinny. I want to know everything. Ah, oh, Murphy. We started the party a little early. I hope you don't mind. Sorry, partner. It's my fault. I just got to hear what's happening at the precinct. In usual fashion, OCP's doing everything in its power to keep the police down. Come on, this is time to celebrate. Lewis is feeling better, Wendell's in jail. Let's party. If you don't think a strike is brewing... You know what? Let me get this grouch out of here so that you two can talk. Okay, okay, I'm going. Feel better, Lewis. You look well. I gotta admit, I sleep better knowing that you got that bastard. But what about you? How have you been lately? Did you get any more of those visions? I still see things. You know, ever since Antonowski showed up, they seem to be happening more often. And with greater intensity. I don't think I've ever seen you in such a state. I just know how it affects me. So I can't imagine how it affects you. The fact that he's the brother of one of those guys who shot you. We should not let the past haunt us. Easier said than done. His presence reminds me of the day that I... that I left you. I often think that maybe if we didn't split up that day, things would have gone down differently. Neither of us could have predicted the consequence of our actions. That doesn't make me feel any less guilty. What I don't get is if Wendell is actually the brother of one of your murderers, then why did he come out now? After all this time? And why didn't he kill you when he got a chance? That is what I intend to find out. Right. Is it true that he's working with someone from OCP? That is what he claims. Damn, Becker. We should just lock him up already. Yeah, we don't have proof. We do not have proof. Not yet. I don't know if you heard, 
but the old man ended up in this hospital after his heart attack. I'm not even sure if he's in a state to talk, but it probably wouldn't hurt to check if he knows anything, right? Anyway, I think I need a little rest after all this excitement. Thank you for visiting me. We'll be back to working together in no time. I look forward to it. <laughs> she looks well weird just lying there. <laughs> the ceiling is very nice. Um, so maybe we go and see the old man. Yeah, VIP wing. We'll just do this and then we'll wrap it up. Did you hear? We're moving the old man to a private clinic in 20 minutes. Good. I don't think I can last a minute longer in this stench. Oh. Hey, where do you think you're going? To talk to the old man. You're the only one who actually showed up to pay him a visit. You know he talks about you a lot. Does he? Yeah, about you being granted human rights. He's rooting for you. So maybe it's not such a bad idea. You can go in. I'm still sus. I'm still sus. Go in here? No. Okay. God, look at this! Whoa. Talking to yourself? I'm dying. Michael, is that you? Your halo shines so bright. He's on drugs. Do not worry, you are safe. Robocop? You came to see me? Like a real friend would? I'm getting close to my final days. And I just can't stand this uncertainty. But you came back from the other side. Tell me, how was it? Was it unbearable? It was like waking up from a long nap. A new man. I hoped that would be the case. I believe that death isn't the end. You are walking proof of that. Unfortunately, I have not completed all I set out to do. All saboteurs inside OCP won't let me. Are you referring to Max Becker? That weasel seeks not only to destroy you, but also my company. Be wary of him. I know you would never let anyone jeopardize the good name of OCP. <sighs> Before you go, could you be so kind and give me some painkillers? Hmm. Okay, do it. That's better. I can always count on. You. I thought he was gonna kill him then. <laughs> <We're> like, <laughs> yeah. We're all good. So we gotta go and. Face, Robo. Uh. Okay. Well, I just did it for you. Uh, so we gotta go and see Becker. Confront Becker. I don't allow you to treat me like this. I am the mayor of this city. Robocop, you yeah, I like Mills. Me. Nah, sorry. See ya. Side missions. Seek answers. You came, so you can follow a command. Surprising. Surrender, or there will be trouble. Defiant as usual. Your creator screwed up the job by not installing an off switch. 
Well, it doesn't pay to fix their mistakes. It's cheaper just to replace you. So, Robocop. Meet the future of law enforcement. <laughs> oh, they got SMGs. Power like yours, but at the push of a button. That is why it is not only more effective than you, but infinitely more obedient. That's just a fragment of the speech I had prepared. But hell, this product speaks for itself. Okay then. Where are they? Where are they? Oh god, there's loads of um... Gunshots? What's going on? Becker has introduced me to these new robots. Wow, we dropped a lot of frames and still are. We are dropping frames here, wow. He's walking away because I think I blew his head off. Jeez, we got nowhere to hide. We got like nowhere to hide. We're okay, we're okay. Oh, you blow their heads off and they just like start walking somewhere else. Okay then, we got through that just uh, heavy pistol. Wow, nice. Reload maybe? No? Uh, should we take an SMG? I mean, yes. Let's take an SMG, why not? Good night! Ooh, we have... Robocop, I got something. A headless UED will start shooting other droids. It's a bug that ended a presentation in front of the OCP board. I'm looking at the footage now. Let us see if they ever got around to fixing it. Warm up is over. Get ready for the real strike. I knew the guy that made you. Bob Morton, right? An arrogant brown nose. I know I've gone really quiet here, but I'm just trying not to die. If it's anything like the other boss fights we've had. It's like, well, bloody, what's his name? Whoa, I'm gonna die now, okay, okay, okay. Not ideal. Oh, health charge at maximum. Maybe we should try this. Execution of justice. Stop resisting arrest. Did that do anything? Wow, something just hit me. What was that? What on earth was that? Give me the bin. Give me the bin. Give me the bin. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, he's up top.
I'm like, you know, like doing the whole thing. I'm like doing the whole thing. Um, certain that your brain was what was making you superior to them so Becker continued to work on the project in secret he took a big gamble hey who are you talking to is where is Becker oh One Becker can I just get up there you are durable I'll give you that you could become a strong part of my urban enforcement where are they Oh. oh, assault rifle. Give me that, please. The the, this gun is not very good. This gun is not very good at all. So bad. Why is it so bad? Like, I'm honestly better off just doing that. I'm so much better off just doing that. That that gun is absolute pants. God, they take a lot. They take a lot, lot, lot. Where's that guy with the sniper? Whoa! Oh my God! I'm gonna die here, dudes. I'm gonna die here. This gun's way better. That guy's still alive, yeah. Give me that. Wow, I just like glitched up the. T Whoa, what's up? What the chuff? He just like ran towards me like big time. Oh, those stupid, stupid, stupid uh, cans. These things are so bad. Wait, where are you? Yeah, that did nothing. Headshots you need. Headshots. Oh, he's still alive. Abide my jurisdiction. You and that damn dispatcher. He's telling you how to outplay my UEDs, isn't he? Becker knows you are helping me. He gave me access to the OCP data himself. Under these circumstances, I feel obliged. I feel like I'm doing well in this fight, but then I'm also like, hang on a second, there's so much health round. Maybe I'm using it all up. Give me that. I'm going up top again. Look how slow you move with a mine. <laughs> what the? Where are they? Oh, I'm stuck. This game can be pretty glitchy. Come on. I feel like there's too many of them now.
Ah, oh, I need that headshot. I need that headshot. Got it. We have no health left. No! No, I'm gonna die! No! I need more health. Oh, it's health. Oh my god, it's health. Oh. Ah, oh, get me up there. I want I want to go up there. You can resist, but it doesn't change anything. I won't let something like you kill my project. Oh dear. No. That went very, 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 very well. I'm gonna die. Dear. No, don't snipe me, don't snipe me. Oh, this is bad, this is really bad. Oh no! This could be the end! Ah! Oh. There's a guy shooting me in the ass here. I'm hoping they're like taking each other out, I guess, but I doubt they are. I've got like 16 health. Come on, somebody come into my eye line here. It's that guy over there I need to worry about. Him. He's the one who's got like, uh, like a machine gun. Oh shit. Come on, dude, this is bad. This is just the same as the... This is like just the same as the Ed 209 boss. Whoa. 
This is seriously just the same as the Ed 209 boss. Oh my god, have I done it? Jeez. That was tough. That was really, really tough. Um, I really thought I was going to not outlast that section, but... Oh, wow. I, I think they've kind of done me a favor a bit by shooting each other because they're stupid. So, yeah, I definitely think... I definitely think that that's helped me there, um, personally. But yeah, it's kind of like the Ed boss. You just have to, like, get in a corner. It's just like, I don't know. How could they fix that? Like, you could... They could go down easier, or... I just don't know. Oh, is there health there? And I missed it. No, oh, it's a mine. What the hell just happened? Becker. Oh, just stop right there. Great performance, RoboCop. And Mr. Becker. It was an excellent presentation. You promised to show me a reliable remedy for this crime wave. And you really did. Yes. I've been working on UEDs for the past five I'm years. I meant RoboCop. He's proved once again that he's still the top player. Excuse me? It just barged in here and started accusing me of conspiracy without a shred of proof. It is not stable. I have Wendell's confession. Oh, do you mean the guy that's been harvesting human organs? <laughs> Very reliable source. You keep forgetting that your organic components are the bane of my entire existence. They complicate things. I need a simple tool. A tool that I can control. And until this remote is in my hands, I have that... Oh! Well, it's uh, time for me to go. Thank you, Mr. Becker, for your presentation. I'll be watching the progress of your project. But until then, keep up the excellent work, RoboCop. And you better keep an eye on that remote. Well, yeah, that was an interesting section. And we're back. Um, yeah, what I was saying was it would... that Those kinds of st uh, strategies with throwing the mines and like running around and collecting them, I just don't feel as though it works that well because they're shooting the living hell out of you when you're um, running around in the open. So you have to just hide. Otherwise you die over and over and over. It's just like, well... How does... I don't know what... I don't know what the actual strat is in that game. Maybe just get better aim, I guess. But I was doing all right, I thought. Um... So, yeah. Right. So, yeah. That was a really interesting section. Uh, very good. I think that was the best uh, best little bit of the game we've had so far. Um, yeah. I kind of zoned out just a minute ago when he was sort of talking. So, is, like, Becca the the baddie? The big baddie? I, 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 I feel like they twisted that back on itself and he's not because we didn't arrest him. Anyway, we'll find out, I'm sure. We're going to leave it here because this episode has gone on way, way long because I decided to do it all in one go. Um, but yeah, it was a really fun section. I uh, really liked the mall part and the sort of story there and then into obviously the big uh, sort of kind of boss battle with the robots. They look so lame. <laughs> it was like, this is my new cop. Check it out. And it just looks so bad. They look so stupid. Um... I'm almost like wondering now as well, is that what they were stealing the brains for? And that's, uh, yeah, I wonder if that's, they didn't seem like they had brains, but uh, yeah, maybe that's what it was, I guess. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, so thanks very much for watching. And if you got to the end of this video and I will catch you in part 10. Ta-ra!